Hey everybody, welcome to Cajun Living and Cooking. My name is Rodney Dupree and today we got a really cool show for y'all. We come out here every year and do this and I look forward to it every year. It's the 57th annual East Ascension Sportsman League Kids Fishing Rodeo. This has been going on for so long and it's really, really fun. So uh, it, it, this show is all about the kids. You know, it's, it's just kids out here in the outdoors having a good time. Uh, we're going to have some winners. We're going to have some good food. Some kids are going to win some bikes. Everybody's going to get a prize and we're going to catch some fish. So y'all hang on. Cajun Living and Cooking is fixing to start right about now. Tide line, trout line, sitting on a pipeline, waiting for the sun to shine. Snap beans, red beans, cornbread and mustard greens, that's how we live and it sure feels fine. Well, you can't change us, that's the way we know. Cajun people live like they did long ago. So join the fun, live off the land, cause there ain't nothing better than a Louisiana Line, travel line, sitting on a pipeline, waiting for the sun to shine. Snap beans, red beans, cornbread, mustard greens, that's how we live, and it sure feels fine. All right, y'all, I got the lady who's the chair lady who puts this on, Miss Betty Lambert. How's it going this morning? It's going really good. It looks like we got a good turnout. Very good turnout. We have about 135 children, and the weather is perfect. It is. So. It is. I see all the fancy trophies we got ready to give out and the bicycles and everything. Yes, yes. Have kids already trying to get on them. Like we always <laughs> talk about, there's, there's too many people to thank for this. You know, you just have yeah. to thank everybody who was a part of it. Definitely. You know? There are many, many, and we could not do it without them, for sure. There's also the people that cleaned this up. Uh, Mr. Virgil is the... Uh, in charge of all of the, yeah. this place, and he has all the people that come out here and clean it up, and we really thank them. And it looks nice. They got it, it, they got it all cut, and the ponds, yeah, weedy, and everything. It is perfect. It is perfect. Uh, it's never been better than this, I don't think. But, you know, that's my opinion. Right. <laughs> well, I'm going to say it for everybody out there. You do a good job for this, Miss Betty, and thank keep you. up the good work. Thank you very much. Thank you. Okay. All right, y'all made it to some kids over here fishing. I'm going to get their names and what school they go to. What's your name? Eli. Eli? What school do you go to? Session Christian. All right. What's your name? Taylor. Where you go to school? Ascension Christian. All right. I see a trend. Your name? Ethan. And where you go to school? Ascension Christian. All right. Y'all caught one yet? Uh, he caught one in that bucket. I caught a there. turtle. You caught a turtle and a fish? Yeah. The fish is like in that, uh. Wait, where the in the turtle? bucket? Yeah. Was it a pretty big one or? Yeah. It's big. It is? Y'all getting a few bites. I seen you getting a bite. I saw a turtle like, yeah. I'm like, oh, I'm going to What you said your name was? Bentley. Bentley, and you got your pawpaw fishing with you, <laughs> and you already caught, you already caught two fish. I know. You, you having a good time? Yes, sir. Yeah, thank you. Y'all sitting in the shade and look like y'all having a good time. I already got some fish. Got your drink right here. Got a good fishing pole. What more could you want, huh? <laughs> About twenty more fish, huh? All right, y'all. We found some more kids sitting over here. Let me get their names. She don't want to say. That's Piper and I'm Oakley. All right. Y'all caught any yet? No? But what y'all fishing with? Worms and crickets? Oh, uh, no. We're doing worms. Worms? Worms. Worms. Okay. What's on your pole right now? I'm a donut. <laughs> yeah, we threw out a piece of donut. <laughs> All right. That might catch a hot dog or something like that. Uh, you never know what they want. Do y'all, how old are y'all? Piper's three. All right. Hey, I'm going to tell y'all, good luck. Thank you. Thank you. All right, y'all, I'm walking along the bank, and who do I find? The parish president out here with some kids. What y'all biting? What they, what they, uh, them found some ants over there, look like. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they, uh, you know, they got a few ants around here. But anyway, they, they enjoying themselves and having a good time. And this is what it's all about, you know, get them out of the house, away from the computers and stuff. Yeah. Yeah, and that's. I seen one kid look like he fished about 30 minutes, and he's already on the iPad over there. So he brought it with him. Oh, Lord, no, they're not going to do that. They love fishing in uh, the outdoors. Well, thanks for talking with me. I'm going to let you get well, back to uh, taking you. care of these fellas. <laughs> i got to go put a bait on. Thank you. Appreciate it. Thanks. Dreams Come True of Louisiana is a nonprofit organization that grants dreams to Louisiana children between ages 3 and 18 with a life-threatening illness. 
Dreams Come True was founded in 1982 by seven families in Denham Springs with a goal of providing dreams to children. All funding was initially provided by those families. Dreams Come True is proud to have one paid employee and provides dreams throughout the state of Louisiana. Dreams Come True provides an average of 65 to 70 dreams per year. Visit our website for more information. DCTOFLA.com. Fred's Bar on the River has something for everyone. Open seven days a week. Football on the big screen TV, pool tables, golf, darts, and the new boat launch bar. Ladies' night on Wednesdays. Thursdays is open mic night. Karaoke on Fridays with DJ Rocky. Live bands on Saturday and Sundays. The Giant River Bar is air-conditioned and ready to book your company's events or your Christmas parties. Come out and enjoy a good time on the river. Junior's Meat Market has everything you need when you're going to the camp, tailgating, or planning dinner. We make our own cracklings, beef jerky, whole head cheese, and sausage right here in the store. We also process deer and hogs. Junior's Meat Market has an abundance of groceries and frozen items, which include crab cakes, fried oysters, tilapia, and more. We have daily meat specials, and we cook plate lunches every other weekend. Stop by Junior's Meat Market today and bring home dinner. You're watching Cajun Living and Cooking. All right, y'all, we made it over to the cooks this morning. I hear they've been here since 5 o'clock working on this 40-gallon pot. Let's get their names and where they're from. Kyle Rodrigue, uh, Thibodeau, Louisiana. Bear Jenkins, Gonzalez. Bruce Burke, Gonzalez, Baton Rouge, yeah. Uh, Jeff Burke, Gonzalez. Man, y'all got it going on out here. I don't know how the kids are going to be able to concentrate with all this smell going on around here. Yeah, well, we uh been out here since 5, and uh, I figured we're going low and slow, and uh, so it's going to be good. Now, what? tell me what you got. You doing 40 pounds of rice? Yeah, we got 40 pounds of rice. We got 35 pounds of sausage and 90 pounds of uh, uh, pork. Woo! That's a lot. And y'all doing the hot dogs and the homemade chili? Yeah, we uh, we, uh, we marinating our hot dogs right now. Uh, they're gourmet, and uh, we got our homemade chili. Uh, we, uh, we actually canned it. We made it at the house, and we canned it, and so it, it come out good. The chili is a tradition out here, y'all, and, and and it's always good. We're going we're gonna to say that. We got over 100 kids signed up, y'all. Go get the chili. We're going to show, we're gonna show the, the homemade chili. chili? Yeah, um, I think we might have some... Um, some rights that we might be uh look at there what it says homemade. this side homemade yeah you see homemade chili homemade so chili it's it's a, it's a seller it the really kids is love it yeah matter of fact kids. this is this is the first place trophy for the kids wow fishing they don't yeah. want a bicycle they want chili they, they want chili yeah that's it y'all all right they got the guys working hard cooking the food and the kids are out catching the fish so y'all hang on all right y'all made it over to another fisherman let me get his name and what school he goes to garrett burke and i go to the pluses primary all right well great jen they're going to fourth. Now, you got a uh, old school fishing pole. This is my style, right? Look at there. Look at there. Reeling one in. That's another keeper. That's pretty. Uh, what you catching with a uh, worm? Yes, sir. All right. You tried crickets? No. No, go with the worm. Looks like it's working. Keep up the good work. Okay. Look at here. Look at here. That's a big fish. Who caught that? There you go. I got seven. What's your name? Grayson. Where you go to school? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> so you done caught seven fish already. And what you catch them on, worm? That's but I'm going to catch ten fish. Oh, you still on a roll. You, st you still got room to improve then. Oh. Gotcha, gotcha. All right, I ain't going to mess you up. I'm going to let you get back to fishing. All right, y'all made it to another fisher woman. Let's get her name and what school she goes to. Jada, French Settlement. Uh, all right. Now, uh, you're working on catching your first one, right? Mm-hmm. Uh, you having a good time, though? Mm-hmm. It is nice. Better yeah. than being at school, huh? Yeah. <laughs> good luck to you. Thanks. I see all the little fish under your cork right there. Must be about 20 of them. I know, right? They don't want to bite the cork? They don't want to bite your hook? There must be 20 fish under there. All right. Good luck. They're biting now. What's up, fellas? Y'all tearing them up? Doing good, doing good. I got some professional fishermen here. Let me get your name and what school you go to. Baylor Bartholomew, Dutchtown Middle School. Trenton Bros, Central Middle School. Y'all catching a few? Yes, sir. Yeah? Yes. What y'all using? Uh, what kind of bait? Worms, just 
Which worms? Using worms. Using worms. Little hook and good worms. Y'all got any big ones? Got anything big yet? He got a few in the bucket, but um, I ain't catching none. That's two nice brim right there. I'm seeing them catch them little bitty ones like that. All right, y'all uh, keep up the good work. And maybe we'll uh, win a bicycle or something. You're the cousin over to the fella over here, huh? Yeah. Tell me, tell me your name and what school you go to. Uh, my name is Aiden Father, and I go to Central Middle School. I see you uh, caught another one. Yeah. That's you know, yeah. You you can <laughs> if you dropped him in the grass and didn't look, you might would lose him. But that's what it's all about, y'all catching the fish as many as you can catch. You, you've been getting a few. Yeah, about what 20, 30. All right, all right. Well, I ain't gonna mess you up. Keep going. All right, looks like you got a nice one. That's a pretty nice one, huh? What's his name? Warren. Where he goes to school? He goes to Zachary. All right, looks like y'all got a few. Oh, yes, we got, I uh, think, this makes eight, I think. All right, all right. Y'all yeah. using worms? Yes, sir, worms. Gotcha, gotcha. Looks like you got a good little spot down oh, yeah. there in the yeah. little. We're rotating out. They'll catch one, we'll catch one, then, we, then we'll rotate. All right, well, it's all good fun, man. This is good. This is good stuff, y'all, and, and and this is what you really like, y'all. The, these boys probably hadn't done too much fishing before, you know. They don't seem to be old enough to do a lot of fishing, but uh, some of their first time fishing out here. Who we got here? Can we get his name? Tell him your name. Jackson. Jackson. You go to school? Yes, sir. Where at? Uh, preschool. Oh. All right. Say Miss Tanya's. Miss Tanya's. Tanya's Kids in Care. All right. right Looks like you catching a few too, huh? Yes, sir. Y'all using worms? Well, keep up the good work. What do you say? Thank you. You're welcome. Living Simoa Supply and Home Center, an authorized hustler, bobcat, and Toro lawnmower dealer. Specializing in service, support, and satisfaction. Come see the wide selection of new mowers, ports, string trimmers, blowers, chainsaws, and much more. Our home center features hardware, feed, outdoor cooking supplies, hunting gear, and everything for the do-it-yourself homeowner. Come take a short country drive to the hidden jewel of Livingston and experience real professional knowledge and health. Livingston Mower Supply and Home Center. The new, completely renovated Fred's on the River Food Mark, located at the Port Vincent Bridge, is now back open and better than ever. With biscuits, coffee, and sandwiches ready every morning at 4.30 to get you started. And a full breakfast menu from 6 a.m. to 10 a.m. featuring homemade hash browns, pancakes, eggs, and our country-style biscuits and gravy. Our newly renovated store has all your needs from local vendors, plus cold beer, lottery, gas, and tobacco. Try our new lunch and dinner menu featuring our famous boat launch burger, overstuffed New Orleans style pressed po' boys, 100% beef hamburgers, pizza, and by far the best onion strings you have ever tasted. So come by and enjoy Fred's on the River Food Mart, where we've come back bigger and better than ever, but we haven't lost our hometown feel. Get those Mr. Beats from them. Yeah, There's a new hunting and fishing store. New hunting and fishing store? New hunting and fishing store? New hunting and fishing store? Yeah, on Highway 44 in Gonzales. It's Ascension Living and Outdoors. They carry a full line of fresh and saltwater baits and tackle, including Matrix, Voodoo Shrimp, Missile, Zoom, and local baits like Delta Lures and Humding. And the hunting section is loaded with calls, scents, knives, attractants, and much more. They even carry deer candy and Nate's buck bait. Oh yeah, ladies, there's even a gift shop. You're watching Cajun Living and Cooking. All right, y'all found some folks out here doing something for a really good cause. It's Ascension Credit Union and the Ascension Ducks Unlimited. Let's get their names and where they from. Paul Mathurin, Prairieville. Kathy Mathurin, Prairieville. Megan Brown, Gonzalez. Olivia Patterson, Prairieville. Aveline Jacks, Prairieville. Deb Kennedy, Gonzalez. Tell me a little bit what y'all doing out here today. Well, today uh, with, the, with the East Ascension Ducks Unlimited, we have put a, a table together to give some information about our Green Wing program. Uh, to all the kids. We're giving free memberships. We have posters, pencils, a copy of the magazine, which if they get a membership, they'll get a quarterly magazine, which has puzzles and pictures and everything. And it's all to, for Ducks Unlimited. That's really nice. That's really nice stuff. And y'all out here giving away... 
Uh, we have free water and goldfish, and um, we've bought a couple bikes to, you know, give away as prizes. So I think this is our third or fourth year associated with the, the fishing rodeo. All right. All right, y'all. There it is. It's kids fishing all over. People helping the kids. People cooking for the kids. It's all about the kids today. So y'all hang on. We're going to have some winners soon. Let me get y'all's names. Anthony. Where do you go to school? Dutchtown Middle. All right. And your name? Caitlin. And where do you go to school? Dutchtown Middle. All right. And your name? Lizzie. And where do you go to school? Um, Dutchtown? Uh-huh. All right. <laughs> Cross point I like your glasses, though. Now you can see. It's the big glare coming off the water right here. Hey, good luck to y'all. All right, y'all. I got another fisherman. Let's get her name and what school she goes to. Breland Watts. And where do you go to school? Ascension Catholic across the river. All right. Have you caught a few fish? Eight. Eight. I seen that turtle you caught. That was a nice turtle. That's mm -hmm. the biggest thing I've seen caught so yeah. far out here. Too bad we can't keep the turtles. You caught eight. What you catching them on? Cricket or worm? Both. Both. All right. Well, good luck to you. Okay. You catching anything over here? Not yet. None. Let me get your name and what school you go to. Carter Rodriguez, South Fork Elementary. All right. You uh, what you using for bait? Crickets. Crickets. And you look. You got one under it. Look, you see him biting it. I see the fish under the water. Look at there. There it is, y'all. Might see one come in. All right, y'all made it to another group of folks over here. Maybe I can get the names and where they're from. Let me get your name. Uh, JP from Santa Mo. All right. Look at here. Let us get this fella's name, where he's from. I'm Mac. I'm from Gonzales. All right. How about you? I'm Destin Dale from Gonzales. You caught any yet? I caught six fish. All right. What you catching them on? Um, I'm catching it on worms. Worms? Yeah. All right. Good job. Good job. So uh, what's your name? Sophia. You go to school? Where do you go? Car GW Carver Primary. All right. So... uh. What bait did you use catching those fish? Red wigglers. Worms. Using the worms. Red All right. Red you pick them up and bait them yourself? Yeah. All well, right. I didn't put them on, but I got them she out of the bucket. Oh, you get them out the bucket. Popo can't hold it, put them on. Yeah, you got to uh, <laughs> use a magnifying glass or something like that. Here go with this fish. Yeah, and that's probably why you catch it. I've seen some with bigger hooks and not doing as well. What we got? What we got? Who we got here? Is your cousin or friend? Or? That's, brother. That's your brother? What's your name? Ellis. Alan, where you go to school? Um, Carver. Carver. At Carver? That's a nice one there. Yeah, it's a big one. What'd you use for bait? Um, worm. You use the worm? All right. Yeah. Can we beat one? No. <laughs> hey, good luck to y'all. Thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. All right, y'all, I got another fisherman. Let's get his name and what school he goes to. Um, my name is Phoenix, and I go to Galvez Primary. All right, I went to Galvez. Look like you got a pile of fish. Mm -hmm. You uh, using worms? No, crickets. Cric oh, you caught them all on crickets? That's some nice fish in there. That's a really nice fish. I don't know if y'all can see that. You probably got, how many you think you got? Like 20. Right around 20, 22? Mm -hmm. That's the leader, I'd say, so far, because that's a good mess of fish. They got some people over there that hadn't even caught one yet, so you're doing good. Keep up the good work. All right, y'all made over to another fisherman. Let's get his name and what school he goes to. My name's Reef Sadboy, and I go to Lake Elementary. How many do you think you got in there? About 10, 12, maybe. You still catching, or the bite slowed down? Or? I mean, they're slowing down, but I'm still catching some. But... You want water break? Yeah. Gotcha. Hey, keep up the good work. All right, y'all made it over to another fisherman. Let me get her name and where she goes to school. Madison Labor, and I go to school at Central Primary. All right. Looks like you're getting a few. How many do you think you got? Eleven. Wow. What uh, what bait you using, or what's the best bait? Worm. Worms. Worms. You fishing with a cork? Mhm. Mm All right. I'm gonna let you get back to it. Good luck. Thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. When you're hungry and you need something quick to do. Show Uncle Larry's doing a few.
Jay will be here in 20 minutes. Please help me, Uncle Larry. With stew and a few, any stew is possible. Just add the protein. Crawfish stew? You must have been in the kitchen all day. Marry me. When you're hungry and you need something quick to do, try Uncle Larry's stew and a few. The Ultimate Escape Rooms. Now currently located in Gonzales. Call and book your room now. With three rooms to choose from, the fun is never ending. Each room has a different level of difficulty to escape. Whether it's team building, family bonding, or just a group of friends having fun together. Kids 6 and under free, ages 7 to 11, 50% off, and 15% off all service members and immediate family. We are also locally owned and operated. Come see if you can escape. Whiskey River, take my mind. Talk to me. Junior's Meat Market has everything you need when you're going to the camp, tailgating, or planning dinner. We make our own cracklings, beef jerky, whole head cheese, and sausage right here in the store. We also process deer and hogs. Junior's Meat Market has an abundance of groceries and frozen items which include crab cakes, fried oysters, tilapia, and more. We have daily meat specials and we cook plate lunches every other weekend. Stop by Junior's Meat Market today and bring home dinner. You're watching Cajun Living and Cooking. Pipeline, trout line, sitting on a pipeline, waiting for the sun to shine. Snap beans, red beans, cornbread, and mustard greens, that's how we live and it sure feels fine. Turkey, squirrel, deer, gator, and hogs, 12-gauge shotgun and some rabbit dogs, staying at the camp six days straight. Coming home to mama sure feels great Well you can't change us, that's the way we know Cajun people live like they did long ago So join the fun, live off the land Cause there ain't nothing better than a Louisiana man Swimming at the lake on a hot summer day Working in the fields, bailing hay Cooking up some turtle sauce, be calm Jitterbug dance until your feet turn raw Well, you can't change, change us, it's the way we know Cajun people live like they did long ago So join the fun, live off the land Cause there ain't nothing better than a Louisiana man Line, trap line, sitting on a pipeline, waiting for the sun to shine. Snap beans, red beans, cornbread, mustard greens, that's how we live, and it sure feels fine. All right, y'all, I got another fisherman. Let's get her name and what school she goes to. Breland Watts. And where do you go to school? Ascension Catholic across the river. All right. Have you caught a few fish? Eight. Eight. I seen that turtle you caught. That was a nice turtle. That's mm -hmm. the biggest thing I've seen caught so yeah. far out here. Too bad we can't keep the turtles. You caught eight. What you catching them on? Cricket or worm? Both. Both? All right. Well, good luck to you. Okay. Members of the East Ascension Sports in the League, and they in charge of weighing all these fish up for the kids and counting them. Let's get their names and where they from. Tori Hayden, Prairieville, Louisiana. And Jim A. Bear, Prairieville. Vince Diaz, uh, Gonzalez. Dane Bourgeois, Duck Roost, Louisiana. Now, y'all been coming out here and doing this a while for these kids. I, every time I've been out here, y'all been here. So, uh, it's something y'all look forward to? Yes, it is. Uh, I've been involved. Uh, my first rodeo was helping Jim when Hurricane Allison or Tropical Depression Allison came in. Oh, wow. So, quite quite some time. And, and, and the see the kids faces some of them's first fish they ever caught out here that's that's just priceless stuff yes it's pretty special and, and this is one of the biggest 
uh, events that the Sportsman League puts on throughout the year. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. We've, we've been doing it for 50-something years. Uh, we all look forward to, to getting out here, and it's a well all machine. Well, it looks like they're all coming, so let's let the fun begin right now. Let's do it. Who we got here? Braxton. Where you go to school? Wake Primary. All right. You caught a few fish yet? I caught two. All right. All right. One big one. You fixing to get back out there and catch some more. Good luck. Thank you. We got over here. My name's Brianna. And where do you go to school? Lake Primary. Did you catch any fish yet? I only caught one. But you're still working on it. Yes. Y'all got about 30 more minutes. Good luck. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. All right. Kaylee, you look like you got a big one. What school you go to? Lake. All right. Well, congratulations on the fish. All right. What's your name? Brianna. How many you caught? One. All right, congratulations. Good luck. My brother called for you. <laughs> Who we got here? This is Sydney. Sydney? Look, look, Sydney, he's talking to you. Hey, Sydney. You go to school? You do? What? You know what school you go to? Tell um, him. Um, a Lord and Center. All right. And hey, what's your name? Caroline. How many you caught? How many fish did you catch? One. One. Got one. All right. That's good, y'all. <laughs> Lying short right now. It's just starting. So they're just lining up. Let me get your name and what school you go to. Uh, my name is Destin Daigle, and I go to Gazelle's Middle. How many you got? Seven fish. All right. Good job. They're getting lined up, y'all. Getting lined up. Everybody's getting in line, getting them weighed in. Biggest fish goes by weight, and then they count count how many fish they have also so we're gonna have a winner here soon all right y'all made it back over to the jambalaya guys and uh looks like it come out really good i heard some uh oohing and eyeing over there yeah it's uh probably the best one we ever made now uh you got to thank somebody for this jambalaya i heard oh yeah verons i tell you we couldn't do it without them they've been a super supporter of this kids fishing rodeo for as long as i can remember and i tell you what hats off to them guys because uh they really come through for us every single year and it, it helps a ton and you know that yeah yeah that's money that you don't even have to go out and spend and and you can almost count on that every year when it comes up they've been real real very very dependable for us well uh we're gonna see how long the pot lasts maybe we'll uh feed everybody out here we got a good crowd today yeah and uh if, like i say if you get a chance spread the word about our homemade chili you got it all right, y'all made it over. This is all the award winners right here. They all they all caught fish, big fish, most fish. I believe we got a fella that caught 51. Who caught the 51 fish? You caught 50. How'd you catch 51 fish? Um, basically, we were using real, real little hooks. And he was tearing them up. Mm -hmm. Hey, congratulations to all y'all. Good job.